Why do people say that sons are easier to raise than daughters? I find it really strange that many people think sons are easier to raise than daughters. Don't boys tend to have lower grades on average and get into trouble more? People tend to stop parenting boys as they get older. So it's easier because they don't care enough to put in the effort. Here's a recent thread that discussed this topic. People say this because they ignore the emotional needs of their male children. And it's socially acceptable to do so. Because we have normalized completely failing our sons by not teaching them emotional maturity and telling them to shove all their feelings down. I agree with everyone else who says that the emotional needs of young boys are very often neglected. Man up. Boys don't cry. But another caveat that hasn't been mentioned much. Most societies don't think we need to teach young boys basic life skills like cooking and cleaning. Meanwhile, young girls need to be taught easy all the household chores. I think our society fails young boys in not teaching them how to regulate and sit down with their thoughts and feelings properly, but also fail to teach them how to survive independently successfully. Because they're stricter on their daughters and teach sons not to show their emotions. They don't give a shit when their son stays out late hanging out with friends. But for some reason they do care when their daughter wants to stay out late with friends. If their son is upset about something, he is taught at home or by society that he needs to hold those emotions in. The daughter is more likely to express those emotions. Because they largely neglect their sons. They don't teach them how to wipe their ass. They don't teach them basic life skills such as cooking or cleaning. They don't teach they how to process or feel emotions. They don't teach them how to relate to other people and take other people's feelings into consideration. They don't teach them how to socialize. People say that sons are easier to raise because they neglect their sons. They don't raise them at all. Because they don't raise them I'm the youngest girl to three older brothers God help them because. WTF. All are so emotionally immature even in their late 30s. Early 40s they are kind of illiterate. It's sad as fuck what people are doing to the future generations of men. They need help. I don't know why but it drives me crazy. Those are usually the same people who say awful things able having a girl. I have one of each and they both have their challenges and bright spots. My parents have told me I've been easy to raise compared to my sister. She's 28 unemployed though so might be unfair in my case. Because people don't actually raise their sons. I think it's tied to the sexist idea that every girl will end up being a terror because hormones. Teacher here, boys are waaay harder in my opinion. People are fucking idiots. That's why. I had a co-worker once tell me that she was glad she only had sons because she didn't have to worry. When they went out, I was sitting there like the fuck are you talking about? Because boys can't be kidnapped and sod? Like, it makes me rage when I hear that. My cousin was abused from 8-12 by a family member so that shit hits home. Because they can say boys will be boys no matter what crap their kids do. And it's an automatic pass to the next level of crap. It's a lot easier if you tell your son to man up and figure it out yourself while try to shield your daughter from reality. Huh. That is never what I was told. The stereotype we learned was that boys were rough and rowdy. While little girls played nice. But girls were more expensive later on proms and the like. Because mothers often overlook bad behavior from their boys and find it absolutely unacceptable in their girls. Women are by far harder on their girls. Because the people who tout these tales ignore the emotional needs of sons and shame the emotional needs of daughters. Girls are harder to raise because of how they approach raising them compared to boys.
I raised three daughters, and it wasn't bad. I don't know what those people are talking about. I wish people would start raising boys to the same standard as girls. Don't even get me started. Because they offload the work of teaching their son's emotional intelligence how to be an active participant in the household i.e. learning how to cook, clean up after themselves, etc. to their son's future partner's spouses. Because people act like girls require 24 by 7 monitoring so they stay pure. Also I've noticed mothers with controlling personalities always complain about their daughters. Being nasty to them. Hum wonder why lol. It's because more people are more strict on their daughters than they are their sons. Some people just also stop parody ignore sons after a certain age because he's a man now. Also toxic masculinity. It's because they micromanage the daughters don't parent the sons. Most people just let their sons become feral. They don't bother raising sons. Teaching them values. How to be polite. Respectful they just do enough to keep them alive. That's what makes boys easier. I've to stop people from hurting my daughter and I've to stop my son from hurting people. Prob BC you have to protect teach daughters survival skills against sexual and physical assault. From men. When I was a teenage boy. I just suffered in silence and was told to man up any time I let out any emotion. Depression and anxiety did not exist apparently and was perceived as weakness. Anyway. This gives the impression that sons are easier to raise because you don't have to deal with. Emotional regulation management. I think that once they have a daughter they realize how fucked up the world is towards them. At least it was that way for my brother. I understand the but men too argument. But girl are victimized way more often than men. My brother never wanted to listen to me or my mother about stuff until it directly affected his offspring. It's not that girls are harder to raise. Because realistically you should be giving both genders the same emotional support. But girls are harder to prepare for the real world based on the things they will be more likely to face. Personal experience. Others will say the opposite based on the same thing. Fathers of daughters are constantly worried about other assholes' sons. They mean boys can't get pregnant nor shame their parents if they lose their virginity. It's absolute BS. Boys can get girls pregnant and there should be no shame if a boy or a girl loses their virginity. Also, boys can be just as emotional or more so than girls. I have one daughter and two sons and none are easier to raise than the other. In the gross words of my co-worker it's easier to worry about one dick than one thousand. Also fathers love to brag about how sex their sons are having with girls. While constantly worrying about their daughters having any sexual desire at all. I have one son and three daughters. If I made a list of everything my son asks of me and another list of everything my daughters ask of. Me you would think I had one son and 53 daughters. Not so it's not they are easier it's the consequences on AF up. Say a 16 year old boy gets a 16 year old girl pregnant where would the baby live? With the girl's parents 99% of the time. You can neglect a son more and face less judgment from other people. Because they don't actually bother to actively raise their boys. Boys. Your whole goal is to keep them from screwing themselves. Daughters. The goal is to keep them from getting screwed haha. -ha. In general. Your son may knock a chick up. But he isn't getting knocked up. He isn't getting raped. He isn't getting attention from older potential suitors. Etc. Also. A lot of the harder issues with girls. Like eating disorders start in teenage years. And finally, a lot of the hardest years for young men come later on when the pressure of societal expectations around work and direction hit. 
In Ireland there's a phrase, boys wreck your house, girls wreck your head.